Part six of River City Girls 2. Let's continue. Alright, so I did a lot I did a lot of offline grinding. And uh, I'll show you here in a minute. Let's just go ahead and go back over here. Um, I believe the last thing that I needed to do was work on... Well, there's a couple of missions that I have. And um, I didn't really like uh, progress too much into the game. I did some uh, accidental exploring. Um, so like there's like some small little dialogue pieces that I... Unfortunately, we'll not be able to replicate unless I start the game over or beat the game in New Game Plus. But anyways, so we were in this area at some point, and um, I will show you that it took a while, but I was able to grind out. Um, oh man, I couldn't even tell you how much it was, but with the smartwatch accessory that you get in the mall, um, these uh, two pins are originally $5,000. Um, with that smartwatch, it puts them down to 4500 bucks. So I had to grind out back and forth for these two guys. And on top of that, I went to some of the other stores and I was able to, uh, to buy a lot of that stuff um, off the videos as well. So let's continue. So in this area, um, there was a small little blurb. I got to take out some of these guys. This was another grinding spot here that I used um, for both some experience and also definitely the money. And um, let's see, the tank button basically uh, times six my attack and the little rabbit thing um, uh, equalizes my speed because with the tank, you move extremely slow with the rabbit, you move a lot quicker. But there was just some small dialogue as soon as I went into this area with Rose. So let's go ahead and see what she uh, has to say. What up, losers? You ready to rock? Yeah, but losers? That's not very nice. Uh, it's me being friendly? Uh, yeah, sure. What are you doing here, Noise? Noise. I'm back in River City for another tour. After my last tour got interrupted by some crime-fighting teenagers. Sorry about that. We were in love. Yeah, I got that. Anyway, there's some weird, dark, magic-y barrier blocking us from seeing through this tunnel. Like it's trying to stop us from performing. Even our headlights won't cut through the darkness. Can't you just drive through it anyway? Hey, yo, traffic safety is no joke. Just because we rock doesn't mean we drive reckless. I guess that makes sense. So now we're stuck here with no way to get to our show in a few hours. Well, we can help you, Noise. Sure, I mean, it's not like we're not already juggling multiple missions. Yeah, but this is for a friend. <sighs> Fine, whatever. I guess we'll go figure out what's causing the dark tunnel spell and undo it then. <laughs> Excellent! You two rock! Now hurry up! Show starts in a few hours. Okay. Not really too sure how to progress, but, you know, we will continue. Um, if I do see one of these... Um, a different variant of these, uh, these mobs here, I'm gonna have to switch off the, uh... The tank pin, because, uh, it's really hard to... Get these guys in your team, because you, like, either one-shot them or two. And, um, oh yeah, I forgot, I am level 30, I am at the... The cap of this game. The level cap, I should say. Not the other cap that young people say nowadays. Anyways, um... So, like she was saying, we have multiple missions. And, uh, let's go ahead and look at the map. I was able to get downtown, so I wonder if we should just, like, explore a little bit into, like, some of the different areas. Let's, uh, do a little bit more... Exploring and also opening up the map. Because, uh, to be honest with you, I've been through these areas a lot. Alright, I'm just gonna... That was like my plan was to ignore these guys. Alright. Collecting money is always great to have, especially 
um with newer areas we could always um get some sort of like food that boosts up our stats okay um let's head to the left and go down let's just ignore these guys just for now um i'm pretty sure that there is a pen that like gives you like maybe like double money and I think that there was one that gave you, like, double experience as well. Um, I don't recall if there's going to be something like that on this game. But uh, the more we explore, the more we can open up the map. Oh, gotta go this way. Let's see what's going on over here. I know that this was a... Uh, watch out for the car. Booth. I don't know where this takes me. It's, this might be downtown. Okay. Yeah, I know exactly where this is at. Um, something about cats is what I saw. I know one of these was like a store. There's like a little like like pachinko store as well. Um, I accidentally went to this area because this is that mall area that has like the fountains. And uh, there was some dialogue saying like, oh, hey, like we're back in downtown again. And that was basically it. Alright. Uh... Okay, so it looks like the store is done. I'm really glad that these machines uh, refresh after X amount of days. I'm not really too sure how how long, but I am glad that they um, respawn, especially if you're really low on health. Um, that used to be a store to get into. I don't know if that's still going to be the case. Let's see what we got here. Beep, beep, boo. Video games here. Okay. Eject. See you soon. This was also like a spot that I grind, grind it out as well. But just see what else is going on. Again, if I don't get them on here, all right, this is a new area. Um, then uh, for sure I'm just gonna keep grinding off stream, stream. I, can't, I keep saying stream, uh, off video just to go ahead and um get as much money as I need to, to start buying all this stuff. Would have been nice to uh, see what's going on there. Can't go in that area. Some mu music from the other parts of town and also from the first game. So that's kind of great to hear. So I'll buy some of that Sega stuff in a little bit. But uh, I remember that this was another grinding area, going back and forth um, a little bit, uh, I think in the next part. Bargain books, I think that's what it said. I'm not too sure. Oh, nice. Oh, that looks like the, the professor model from the uh, first game. And here's all our all our guys over there. Well, I'm happy to see that we have a um, spot in town on this, side, on this side. I did some more leveling with the other characters. Um, I think I got majority of everyone to like level 12. I think uh, Kunio, I got him to like 15, if I'm not mistaken. Just because I, I just, I mean, uh, was it, uh, Masako was already level 30 and stuff like that. Good, now the store to visit. Always happy to see stores. Uh, we can get more accessories and also um, any type of like boost 
Feminine goods. Feline goods. <laughs> Feminine. Ah. Okay, so this is probably going to be another mission. Oh, that's right. Yes, we got to find cats. Hey! I know that voice. We're leaving. Stop. Be nice. Nope. I am not putting up with one more single minute of... Mihoko, it's so good to see you. Likewise. What brings you two out here? Oh, you know, beating people up, taking back our usual hangout spots from those dumb Yakuza jerks. Same as usual. Totally. Where's your little doggy? Oh, Molly McMuffins? She was being naughty, so we had to... get rid of her. As in, like, get rid of her? What? Oh, no, of course not. I gave Molly to my sister, but that's part of a broader life change. I'm into cats now. That's why I'm here at this cat cafe. This is my hell. Only problem is, the cats all escaped. Will you two help me around them up? Spoke too soon. That's my hell. Now we're in it. We'd be happy to help you out. What do these missing cats look like? There's 20 of them, each with the sweetest, cutest, rudest, little, squatchy face. Yeah, okay, we got it. 20 missing cats on it. Good luck! That's pretty funny. I know that um, early on I got a t-shirt saying, like, you... There's powerful as many cats and stuff like that, so I can only imagine that like an OP build, like an instant kill build might be getting all the cats and um, equipping the tank button or pin, not button. Um, it's a strategy. Um, it does make the game a lot easier, though, <laughs> which is, you know, it's not a bad thing. What happened to E Honda? Lord have mercy. Okay. So, noise figure. Um, I think we can probably... Let's see. I'm gonna put the smartwatch on. Enter. Look Luck is definitely something that I want. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Nice. Uh, wow, that was a lot of money. But it definitely offered a lot of stat buffs, which is great. Okay, I'm going to put that there because... Um, nope, I did not want to do that. There we go. Just so that way, like, if I leave the store and there's, like, a lot of these guys here... Um, even though I'll be slow... I will be able to, like, uh, you know, beat him up really quickly. Okay, so we got a fast travel spot here. Nice. So pretty much, I think, like, this part, um, and again, like, I beat the other game in, like, six or seven, or seven parts, if I, if I can recall. Looks like there's zombies in this area. Ooh. These zombies are tough. Um, that was to the point where I had to like make sure I had the right uh, the right pins on and stuff like that. But we're just gonna see what's going on. Um, this used yeah this used to be a store, a little pawn shop in the first game. Oh, it still is. <laughs> Woof. Ooh, nice. Bow -wow. Woof. Um, I'm gonna see what he sounds like in Japanese. Alright. I've been doing that too, just like swapping back and forth uh, between the English and Japanese. Um, I think in New Game Plus, I'll probably switch to Japanese. Woof. Oh, it's still the same. Luck 3, 100%. Bart. Woof. 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 Woof, woof. 
Woof, woof. <laughs> Was that it? That was uh Yeah, no, I guess that was it. That was the, this entire building and stuff like that. I do have to go back. Um I don't know if that's part of the hundred percent. I could be wrong. Actually no, not maybe not really. Um with some of the other characters and stuff like that, going back and um going back and uh getting all these buffs for them and stuff like that. I'm not really too sure. Um, and on top of having all four of these characters, we're going to have another set of two. So there's that to keep a... keep in mind and stuff. But yeah, let's explore a little bit more. Let's open up the map so that way there's no... no sort of like surprises at all whatsoever. And uh, it also makes things a little bit easier for me to, to like grind and not having to stick to the same spots over and over and stuff like that, you know. And that way, in case I accidentally uh, proceed a little bit further, um, whatever small dialogue, at least it's there. Okay, so this looks familiar. This was another, this was that area that I remembered doing a lot of like back and forth because uh there was uh an increased chance to get like those uh special variant uh characters but this entire area uh here is brand new so i remember going into that last um section to the left and it would immediately take you over here if i recall I don't know. Anyways. I know that this was a... There was a boss battle in there. Okay, so it looks like this is uh, two accessory shops. What else we got? There was a cat up there. Your weapons are much uh, deadly. Hot shirt. Uh, chance of poison and stuff like that. Okay. See you later. Or not. Whatever. So I'm going to come back for that one. Got the ninja guy to my, my way up here. Nice. That was not what I meant to do. actually useful to a point see you around now let's make it a regular thing nice anyways uh, I'm not necessarily like out to look for accessories all that much just because I mean I have the pretty much the two like end game accessories right now um, it was nice for grinding to use um, I think it was like the nails the deck uh, decal nail or whatever the hell and uh there was another uh item that you got 
health back from money. This entire area just like a spot for a shop. Oh no, there's more. What do we got? Enter, please. Tengu welcomes all. <laughs> We meet again on the path of our lives. I know that these two ladies here, they really offer a lot of money. Uh, the Yakuza lady, not so much. This guy, uh, yeah, no, this guy's not, not too bad. So, like, if there's a lot of these, like, sort of, um, different types of enemies. Oh, here we go, another mission. What else is over here? Um, I am gonna go back and buy some food. Oh yeah, Bobo or Babo, whatever the hell his name was. But uh, yeah, let's go back. I'll ignore her for now. Oh yes, it was the the bomb bottom uh, and the deco uh, nails. That was a good combination early on for grinding because you got your health back. And, um, you could also get some health back, uh, by doing combos. Alright, luck is definitely what we're gonna go for. A rarity, indeed. Such treasure. Despite my nose, my prices are always honest. Nice. See what I mean? Like, it's always great to have the, um, the tank, the tank accessory on. So that way, you know, you can quickly just double tap A. sort that out especially if there's like a like an in, uh a pretty close spawn point from these enemies and stuff because if you're not careful like they just everyone like just wails on you and you're like what the hell or at least that's what i say to myself but uh i'm specifically looking for an accessory that would like double up either experience or health and i know it's gonna be super expensive Yeah, having the luck really is useful because um, I believe that gives you like an enchance, an increased chance of like either getting a larger amount of money and health items, if I'm not mistaken. Not only too sure, it's just kind of like what I, what I'm guessing. So we got Bobo over there. Or Bobo. <laughs> oh. Interesting. Okay, so we got a maximum security facility. Okay, so this looks like a... It's own sort of new area that... uh Oh, there's a cat, by the way, right there. I just saw it right there in the electric fence. Um, we can see what the other NPC guys have to say, at least just to get those going on this part. Um, I can even try to get some of this money here. But noted. Alright, so we're at 24. Okay, this one might be a little bit longer than some of the other parts, just because I really want to open up this map quite a bit and explore the areas. Look at all that health right there. That's what that luck gives you. You get health for days and stuff. 
And uh, I'm trying to think like what else, like what are the other areas that I can think of that we need to go? I guess it is possible. Uh, I'll explore that in a minute. <laughs> Let's go talk to Babu or whatever his oh, name hey, is. Abubu. Abubu. Dressing up for Halloween or something? A fun fun smash! Uh, don't compare me with that loser, Abubu. You're not him? I look like him. Probably in a black and white photo. Or if it's very dark, maybe? My name's me Bobo. And it's my job to keep losers out of this sweet nightclub. How do you know we're losers? Because you ain't in here. <laughs> He's got us there. Pretty airtight logic. Any chance you could let us inside? Not unless I know you've got some sweet dance moves. Well, uh, sure we do. We're teenagers. Yeah, we're all great at dancing or whatever. No, uh I ain't falling for that again. You gotta prove it. How? Go get a top five score on that dance game in the arcade. Do that, and I'll let you inside. Can our friend Hiroshi get the high score? Yeah, we heard he's pretty good at that game. Not unless you're trying to get him inside this club. Fine, we get it. We'll be back. Oh. I was gonna ninja guide in, or wall jump, I should just say. Off that little sign there. Son of a. No, at least that. I'll push me forward. There's a lot of these guys here.
Almost got up to a thousand again. Alright. Just because I am curious and I really want to know what's up here. Okay, so that's an invisible wall. Or the end of the area. Yeah, it doesn't seem like I can go any further. But I do see like these orange areas. So something tells me. even does this even matter i don't think so oh okay all right something's due later go um oh that's another all right nope press select instead of start so now we're gonna have to switch uh maybe this right here The, uh, the rapid thing is really making it hard to line this up. Nice. Oh. See, this is what the rabbit does. Like, speedrunner's dream. Let's see where else can we go. What else can we open up? All right, looks like there's some areas that lead into blank. See our new little little mascot lady. Nice. Let's see, and we will do a cheeky little save here.
Yeah, we're going to be calling it pretty soon. I just want to uh, explore a little bit more of the map. This doesn't look like a bad spot to grind, actually. Just because uh, it looks like you got a little bit of some of these higher level enemies. And also, there's uh, if you need health, there's the uh, safe house right there as well. So not too bad. These little mascots generally have quite some, quite a bit of money in these uh, KO ladies. Or... What is this? Is this the game store? Yeah, it is. Press jack. See you soon. All right, so that's about 400 bucks right there. I gotta stop getting distracted and going from <laughs> just going for enemies and trying to kill them uh, or not or beat them up for their money but uh all right let's just ignore some of these guys um i think there's a bus station if i go this way so we'll do that yeah so that was the door that i went to and accidentally um triggered the uh that missed dialogue Yeah, no, I mean, it took like a couple of hours and stuff like that, but 100% grinding out to get the tank and the, and the little rabbit pins and stuff like that is really, really nice to put on uh, lower level characters if you want to grind them up. Okay, um, all right, so the map is definitely opening up now. We got the purple area, and let's see if we can go a little bit further to the right. See, what, oh, actually, that's where noise is at. Oh, I totally, totally uh, spaced on that one. I thought this was gonna take me to another area. Did well as soon as I figure out what to, what to do there. Just going to st steal some money. But it was great. Uh, also working on my stats and stuff like that. Um, I really hate these guys. These, they, them and the like schoolgirls, like they have like this weird, like perfect timing. You're aggressive and they just like, like cock it back and just smack you right in the face. So let's see if we can go left three places and up and see if we can go uh, north. We'll try that if we can. If not, actually, I think that's, you know what? I don't, we can't. That's the subway, I believe. We'll check it out, and then um, once I'm proven right, uh, yeah, that is the subway because uh, this is a three-stage area. Because it's this one, and then it's the fire pit, and then it's going to be the the uh, little store um, with the big guy in it. Oh, and uh, check out this graphical glitch right here. You can go inside that box. There's no collision that I'd share yeah and then up I think up top here that was uh, the mission that we needed to fix the generators yeah this little bookstore here I did I buy everything yes I did come back anytime meaning that like I got all the, uh, the little stats for that yeah yeah. Because is this the one up north? It sure is. Yep, that's... Uh. Okay, so we're running into the 
issue that we got to start completing missions. And uh, there's a lot of these, uh, a lot of the other parts is just like exploring and, and me doing a lot of talking. So that'll be the main focus for part seven. This one might actually be like a, maybe like a 14 or 15 parter and stuff like that. So we'll see. Um, obviously they will, I can cut down the longer I play and stuff like that. It just depends on what I'm doing for sure. Okay. So let's just go ahead and what's down, what's down there. Is there a bus stop? There is. Ooh, you son of a gun. Oh, wow. But yes, I do recommend this game. Uh, the entire series and stuff like that. I mean, Zero was great if you really want to uh, be part of the continuity in terms of uh, what these... Uh, new takes on, on, on the on the characters and stuff like that. It's a really great series. And um, I would say that uh, it's 100% thanks to Game Pass because I think that's where I found this series on. Or, um, it was so good that I downloaded it on the PC. <laughs> the, the, the PC... Uh, games uh game pass and stuff like that and i got extra achievements and stuff like that because that's just my jam so let's go ahead and we'll head to a, a safe house um we can go back to the original we'll do that and then we'll call it and then um the next part for sure we're gonna have to um focus on completing missions I think uh, we did enough exploring and stuff like that. 100%. But anyways, all right. So that's going to be it for part six. Um, this is going to be a long series. I do recommend this game. Um, and yeah, I guess that's all I can say. But anyways, alrighty, kids. You take care of yourselves and I'll see you soon.